Hello, this is Eric at Prince George Ford, and we're taking a look at the 2019 Ford F-150 in a Lariat trim and powered by a 3.5 liter V6 EcoBoost engine, providing you with plenty of power and great fuel efficiency. Also coming with a bug deflector and a couple of accessories installed here at Ford, such as a 6-inch BDS lift, 20-inch Amer American Racing ATX rims, pocket-style fender flares, and bulletproof mud flaps on the front and rear tires. And then you also have running boards so you can get into your big old lifted truck. But let's take a look inside. So first looking in the back where you have pretty spacious seating for three with a nice full leather interior. And in the center you have fold-out armrests with two cup holders as well as two more right there with a 12 volt, two USBs, a 110 volt, and heated rear seats. So your back passengers are pretty well set up in this truck. And then the seats can be folded completely up and out of the way to accommodate any other cargo you want to put back here. So you do have quite a bit of storage space in this truck. Now looking at the front, this is a proximity key vehicle, so no need to uh, fiddle with any keys. Just put it in your pocket or purse and you're good to go. And looking in, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, as well as three memory buttons for your power adjustable driver's seat, steering wheel, mirrors, and even your audio levels in your center console. So now sitting in the truck with it running and looking at the steering wheel, on the right hand side you have your hands-free phone and radio controls, and on the left hand side you have your cruise control buttons, and then you have your controls for your center screen here, where you can look at things such as your trip 1 and 2 stats, so time taken, distance driven, fuel economy during said trip, your actual fuel economy and fuel history, compass, and your auto start stop. And then you have truck info such as your turbo, tire pressures, digital speedometer, engine info, and then you also have your towing info and status, your off-road status, and uh, settings for some of the features around your vehicle and the setup of your screen here. And then you also have a favorites view where you can put any of those subcategories for ease of access. But then moving on to your center, uh, your infotainment screen, which is radio series and Bluetooth, I believe. So you do have some nice options for whatever you want to listen to, however you want to listen to it. And then you have your digital climate controls with dual climate, so everyone can stay at whatever temperature they're happy with. And then you have your Bluetooth phone control, navigation screen, so you're hopefully not going to get lost on your travels, whatever apps you may have installed, and then settings for your screen and some other stuff around your truck. Uh, do also have a heated steering wheel in this truck, so uh, nice for those colder months. Uh, back to home. Also shifting into reverse, you do have a backup camera with rear sensors, so you're going to be able to see where you're going and hopefully avoid hitting anything. And then you can zoom in on where your hitch would be if you want to have an easier time connecting a trailer or something else. Uh, here you have the button for your heated steering wheel. Uh, above that you have your traction control off and your auto start stop button, uh, so when you're vehicle is sitting idle, uh, it'll shut off the engine to conserve fuel and cut down on emissions. Also has a premium Bang & Olufsen sound system throughout the vehicle, so your, uh, whatever you're listening to is going to sound pretty nice in this truck. Then you have your physical media controls and your physical climate controls with heated and air-conditioned front seats so you can stay cozy or cool. To the left of that you have your 4x4 controls with 4 auto and your trailer backup and trailer brake, brake controller. and then this is also a push to start once again with the proximity key and to the right you have a 12 volt and 110 volt power outlet then down here you have this compartment which opens to reveal two usbs and some space for your stuff uh, then you have your main shifter with select shift so you can manually shift through your gears then you have two cup holders a cubby here and your locking center compartment slash armrest here with a removable tray and plenty of space inside for all of your stuff and another 12 volt power outlet so you can plug something in there. So that's pretty nice. But then looking back, you do also have a power rear sliding window. And then looking up, you have a nice twin panel moonroof so you can let in the beautiful sunshine on a day such as today. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day.